Which type of virtual phone system is right for your business? Cloud-based VoIP or on-premise PBX? In this video, we'll cover the differences in features, call quality, and pricing between VoIP versus an in-house PBX. Let's get right to it. The key difference between PBX versus VoIP, or Voice Over Internet Protocol, is that a standard PBX system uses landline phones to facilitate voice calling over the PSTN network, while VoIP makes and receives calls via broadband internet connections. VoIP is a feature-rich business phone system that uses the internet to make and receive calls instead of the physical copper wiring of the public switch telephone network, or again, PSTN. Unlike landlines, VoIP virtual phone systems are not limited to a singular location. They're accessible in any location and on any device with working internet connection. VoIP works by compressing outbound voice audio into small data packets that travel to their destination via an internet connection and then reassemble into the correct order before being played to the call recipient. This process is repeated back and forth throughout the conversation. PBX, or Private Branch Exchange, is a premise-based in-house phone system that facilitates voice calls using the traditional PSTN. Because it's fixed to a singular location, on-premise PBX offers greater control and security than VoIP. Since PBX is essentially a private in-house network, businesses avoid the expense of purchasing additional phone lines from service providers. Now let's compare VoIP versus PBX features, costs, hardware, installation, and reliability. As you can see here for starters, PBX phone systems have limited features compared to VoIP solutions. Now on to cost and pricing. Businesses that switch from a traditional PBX to a VoIP system lower their communication costs by as much as 50%. VoIP phone systems don't require the purchase of new hardware or on-site installation. They offer unlimited local and long-distance calling and have scalable, tier-based pricing. Most VoIP phone systems cost between $20 and $50 per user per month. In contrast, on-premise PBX users should expect to pay at least $7,000 in initial costs, including new hardware, hardware maintenance, and installation software licensing, and office space. For larger companies, an on-premise PBX system can cost $25,000 to $50,000 or more. Now let's take a look into call quality and reliability. Though PBX call quality is mostly stable as it operates via the PSTN, it can still be impacted by echoing, dropped calls, and the weather. In contrast, VoIP comes with HD audio, noise cancellation, and optimized bandwidth usage, plus a minimum 99.9% .9 guaranteed uptime backed by geographically redundant data centers. However, since VoIP operates via the internet, a weak connection could mean dropped calls, jitter, and latency. To optimize VoIP service, have a minimum bandwidth of 100 kilobits per second per phone line and purchase a backup power supply. Now on to scalability and flexibility. Because VoIP systems aren't limited to a single location or device, VoIP is much more flexible than PBX. VoIP users can instantly scale to a higher tiered plan add phone lines or users, and purchase add-on features directly on the provider's website. Adding lines to a PBX system requires a time-consuming and expensive on-site installation, and users still can't access their PBX phone system outside of the physical office. Now for security. Now while no provider can, nor should, guarantee zero risk of data breaches or privacy violations, PBX is slightly more secure than VoIP because it doesn't rely on the internet to make and receive calls. However, most VoIP providers offer NN encryption, HIPAA compliance, third-party security testing, multi-factor authentication, and 24-7 network monitoring with real-time suspicious activity alerts. Now for the big question. PBX versus VoIP, which one should you choose? When deciding between VoIP versus PBX, in the vast majority of cases, VoIP is the overall better choice. Compared to premise-based PBX, VoIP offers significant cost savings, greater mobility and device flexibility, advanced features, and strong security standards. Furthermore, since the PSTN will be formally switched off in December of 2025, most businesses should not invest in a new premise-based PBX system. However, hosted PBX systems, the cloud-based alternative to premise-based PBX, have exploded in popularity. SIP Trunking 2 connects an existing premise-based phone system to the cloud, giving teams access to VoIP features. If you found this video informative, Give it a like, smash that subscribe button, and hit the notification bell below to keep up with our journey to simplify the VoIP world. Till next time, this is Nate from Get VoIP.